But why education? In the year 2014, we see that South Africa celebrated a 75.8% pass rate throughout the country. However, it was hard for us to celebrate when we knew the statistics behind it. In 2003, 1.1 million children were enrolled in Grade 1. Of those 1.1 million learners, only 530,000 made it to matric. That means 5 out of 11 children made it to high school. From the pool of 530,000 learners who reached matric, only 400,000 of the learners passed their matric exams. Then only 4 of those 5 learners ended up passing matric. Further to this, only 150,000 learners passed with bachelor passes. That means 3 out of 10 learners passed with the bachelor's pass, allowing them entrance to university. So what happened to all those learners that never made it to matric? that never even made it to high school? And what is the domino effect of our country caused by these statistics? In 2012, I was approached by one of the founders of the Shoe Foundation. At the time, I was at a poorly funded primary school and had very low chances of attending a quality high school. I live with my single mother, whose salary is only enough to sustain our living needs. When I was approached, they said they were impressed with my school results and drive for wanting to achieve well academically. With that, I got offered a full scholarship to attend an affluent high school. I'm in grade 11 and am pleased with what I have achieved so far. I have a bronze in President's Awards and have helped give back through a school club. I play first team netball. I have attended a Yale Young Scholars program in Zimbabwe. And with that, I have been able to maintain a 65% plus aggregate. This opportunity to attend such a good high school with no financial stress on my mother has opened me up to so many more opportunities that I knew existed. I hope that after matric, I can go to one of South Africa's finest universities to study occupational therapy. These opportunities are what make a difference not only to me and to other youth like me, but help make a difference to a better South Africa. My name is Nontigele Lofogazi. Not only am I thankful, but I am excited to be part of such a change. So why education? Because it's our greatest weapon to make a change.